thrown out. Ten Russian spies leave the U.S. through New York's LaGuardia Airport, bound for Russia via Vienna. The suspects all submitted guilty pleas in a Manhattan courtroom and accepted being deported. As they were transported to the departure lounge, their lawyers spelt out the terms of the agreement. She can only come back to the United States after direct authorization by the United States government. Upon arriving in Russia, she can leave and go to any country in the world. In this case, she's going to Peru. Well, she can't go to the U.S., and that was the agreement. He understands what he was facing here. Now he'll be free, a free man, and he'll go, back to, he'll go to Russia. And from there, he can go anywhere he wants in the world. The defendants included an employee at an accounting firm, a real estate agent, and a columnist for a Spanish-language newspaper. They led double lives using fake passports and secret code names as they passed on information. Russia will pardon four people accused of working for Western intelligence agencies in the biggest spy swap since the Cold War, a move the Russian Foreign Ministry says will help build a constructive partnership with the U.S.